I'm Hunter Joslin and I want to improve your surfing using the Indo Board Balance Trainer. Now the word trainer, I kind of don't even like to use that because when I was a surfer I never trained. I just went out and flip flopped around in the ocean and tried to get better. Except when I came home, I used a balance board to have fun, to spend time because it felt just like my long board. But now they're short boards. What's the difference? Nothing. The basic elements of surfing are all the same. Whether you ride a short board or a long board, whether you want to surf like Joel Tudor, whether you want to surf like Kelly Slater, the very basic elements are all the same. And the mistakes that are made by the average surfer are all the same. Also, it applies to riding the Indo board. The same basic elements of balance on the Indo board translate directly to surfing. So if you can surf better, why not? Mama used to tell me hard work was the only way, yeah. Oh no. But mama, I'm tell you I found a better way to get paid, yeah. Wow. Cause I do my thing in the morning and I do it in the night. Oh, any time in between just to make you feel alright, right, right. right. Think about it, when you're riding a wave at home, unless you're lucky enough to live on a point break, your average wave or ride time is about five, maybe eight, ten seconds. The Indo board, you can ride it for minutes on end, hours on end, if you get that good. And all that can do is relate directly to improving your surfing. We're checking out wild and crazy kids. We got some wild and crazy kids here, but we also have Hunter Jocelyn, the man, Indo board invented. It's water sports day, so the Indo board is a way to help you learn how to surf. So tell me a little bit. Yeah. Yeah.